Hi there and a very warm welcome to my channel. So if this is the first video that you've ever stumbled across of mine and you've not seen me here on YouTube before then let me introduce myself. My name is Charlie and I'm from Teesside and I upload here on YouTube twice a week. However from the 1st of December which isn't that far away I'm going to be taking part in Vlogmas. That means I will be uploading a video every single day throughout December. So if that's something that you are interested in, then why not consider subscribing to my channel? All you've got to do to subscribe is hit that red subscribe button down below or you can hit the watermark in the corner. So today's video, as you can tell by the thumbnail and the title of this video, I am bringing you a white company dupes video. But not just any white company dupes video, I'm bringing you a Christmas edition. So I've been on the White Company website and I've had a look at all of their beautiful Christmas decor and I've been to budget stores and I've managed to pick up some dupes, what I think are dupes or what look very similar to the ones that I've seen in the White Company. So without further ado, let's just get into this video. So when Amanda asked me if I wanted to do this collaboration, I jumped at the chance because I know the last time that we collaborated, it was such a success. She picked up some absolutely brilliant products and I also picked up some really good products as well. I will leave Amanda's channel down below, as I said, so when you finish this video, go over to Amanda's and check out what she's picked up. I'll also leave the White Company Dupes collaboration that we've done before down below so you can go back and have a look if you've not watched it yet if you are new but i'm just going to get straight into it and i'm going to show you some of these fantastic items that i've picked up so normally with a white company dupes video i normally put up the white company product and then i show you what i've picked up and that's exactly what i'm going to do today so the first thing that i'm going to show you is duping this wrapping paper now this wrapping paper in the white company is 16 pound and it just says Merry Christmas all over it, very, very subtle. So I went into B&M and I picked up this wrapping paper. Now it looks very similar to the one that's on the White Company and I did pick up a few of these. You get three metres of wrapping paper and I, I do think the one in the White Company, I think you get 10 metres for £16. But this just says all over it, mistletoe kisses, Christmas wishes and it just reminds me so much of the one in the White Company. So I thought this was a really good dupe to the one from there. And for £1.50, now I'm not being funny, I would love to wrap all my presents in White Company wrapping paper. However, can you imagine on Christmas morning, handing your presents out and then just ripping that paper open? That would be like saying, there's £20 there, just rip it up in front of me. I would be crying if... I seen someone ripping £16 paper off their presents. I'd want them to peel it off. So I don't mind finding a dupe for £1.50 when it's only going to be ripped off on Christmas Day. So that is my first item that I've picked up and I'm going to go back and get some more because I do think that this is going to be my wrapping paper this year. So I am going to stay on the wrapping side of things for a moment. And I have picked up a selection of ribbons. Now, the ribbons that are in the White Company are £6 a reel, which, again, I don't think is too bad, but I found some dupes. So the first one that I'm going to dupe is this white ribbon, and it says love on it. Now, the ribbon that I've picked up is not exactly the same, but it gives me the White Company vibes. So this one was £6 in the White Company and the one that I've picked up is a beige ribbon and it just says Seasons Greetings on there in a gold font. So these were £2 each or three for £5 and I think these would look absolutely gorgeous on brown paper if you're using brown paper for your wrapping. But like I said, it's not a complete dupe but it does give me a White Company look and the vibe and I just think with brown paper with this ribbon 
you wouldn't know that it's not from the white company so i did pick up three of them because they were two pound each or three for five pound which i just think is an absolute bargain the next ribbon that i've picked up the one in the white company is this one so it's a red velvet ribbon and again that is coming in at six pound now if you were to wrap all of your presents in this ribbon it's gonna cost you quite a lot of money as well as using the white company wrapping paper you think how much one present would cost to wrap so i went into one beyond and they have got a velvet ribbon and it's in that burgundy now i just think this is duping the one on the white company so much now i had this last year and again i picked it up this year so this is what it looks like very similar to the one that's on the white company and this one was one pound a roll so that was five meters long and it's 25 millimeters wide i don't know what the size is on the white company one but this looks very similar and i'm not being funny but i'd rather spend one pound on velvet ribbon than six pound for the white company one and you're just going to get the same look so this would look absolutely beautiful with white wrapping paper the white company just have that significant look where it's white and red at christmas i love everything from the white company but if i was to buy all of this from the white company it would cost me an absolute fortune just to have aesthetically pleasing wrapping paper i think you could create a white company present like a gift box so if you do buy anything from the white company and you get a gift box my advice to you would be always to opt for the gift box to not be assembled because then they're going to send you the stickers the white company stickers that you can stick on your gift and they also send you the box that's not assembled and it always has a black bow so this is what i mean so if you give me a box with a black bow on it i would instantly know that is from the white company and you can create that packaging so you just need to get a white box now poundland sell white boxes um you can get the white company sticker if you've ever bought anything from the white company and you've asked for the box to be not assembled and then when i was in b and m i noticed that in the scandy snow range they had these velvet bows now these were three pound and you get six in there and i just thought to recreate that gift box from the white company you could use these now these must be new this year because i don't think i've seen these last year in b and m because if i did i would have picked them up so last year i done the brown paper with the red ribbon and i think this year i am going to stick with white paper with black bows and white paper with red bows but i'm also going to incorporate this as well but i just thought if i wanted to create a white company parcel then these bows would be absolutely perfect for that so they do just hook on like this now i would like to see if i can get some black velvet ribbon because i think that would look really nice to wrap your parcels with your black ribbon with your black bow but i just thought for three pound you could dupe a white company gift box so i've noticed on the white company that this year they're doing their nordic star in jute now last year i picked up this one for the video collaboration with amanda and i think it was 30 pound in the white company and i bought it a hobby craft for five pound now this year the one in the white company i will put a photograph here it is exactly the same however this is all covered in jute now i love to diy things and this wouldn't take long to diy at all so i went to poundland i bought some jute because that's the cheapest place that you can buy jute is Pangland. And I'm going to wrap this in jute. 
The one in the white company is £38. Now this cost me £5 and I'm going to wrap it in Poundlands Pound Jute. So there's £6. And I've just got a massive saving. So if you're looking to get one of these stars and you've seen them on the white company and you think well, that's a bit pricey, go to Hobbycraft, get yourself one of these stars and do it yourself. Wrap this star in jute from Poundland. So this is what I'm going to be duping. So yes, it's not exactly the same, but I am going to do a DIY. I'm going to make this look very similar to the one that's in the White Company for £38. So the next item that I'm going to show you, I haven't actually got the dupe, but I have took a photograph and it is this one. Now this is from B&M, it's £6 and it reminds me of the botanical candles that the White Company do. So this is a little bit back to front because I'm showing you the dupe here. And I'm going to show you the white company product that's in front of me. And the only reason that I do say that is because I would not buy a dupe of these candles because I know the smell payoff with the white company candles and I don't know the, the payoff on these candles. And I always opt for a white company candle. So if you've been here for some time, you will know I love DW Home and I love the white company. And they are the only two places that I do actually like to spend my money on candles so this is the dupe and it's six pound and this is in the clementine now they did have it in the winter spice now this is the size of the one that i've just showed you so i'm showing you the sea salt one from the white company now these ones are 35 pound in the white company compared to the one in b&m for six pound so if you just want the white company look and you're not really bothered about the scent payoff then go for the dupe now that would be the size of the one that was duping but because they have it in a winter scent it would look like this this one is obviously the medium size one from the white company so this is a little bit more expensive this one is £42 in the White Company, but I've seen these in places like Aldi, The Range, b and I've even seen them in Dunelm. At Christmas time, Aldi do the really big one of this, and I think it's about £25. Um, again, I don't know what the scent payoff's like, so I can't give you an honest review on that. What I can say is these smell absolutely amazing these fill your home with a scent even when they're not lit so this would be the one that you get from the white company and this would be the dupe so i didn't pick up the dupe because i do have the originals so now we're going to move on to christmas baubles so the first ones that i'm going to show you is duping this one now yes this one is only four pound and imagine having loads of them on your tree it would cost you quite a lot of money now i went into b&m and i've picked up two of them for three pound fifty so what it would cost you for one in the white company you can actually get two in b&m and all i would do is i would just remove this dangly one so if i just lift that off it is duping the one in the white company so if i was going to be putting all these on my tree i would be buying these ones removing the heart in the middle because if i wanted to buy 10 from the white company it would cost me 40 pound if i was to buy 10 packs of these which would give me 20 it would only cost me 35 pound so it is a big saving it is worth going out and having a look for dupes do what i do look on the website you can also request a brochure from the white company all you've got to do is fill out your details and they'll send you a brochure every different season change so when it comes to spring they'll send you a, a brochure out when it comes to summer they also do that and they're nice for little coffee table books as well i use them for coffee table books sometimes 
but this is where I get my inspiration from out of them magazines and out of the books so that I can go and have a look around the budget friendly shops. So this is the dupe to that heart bauble. Moving on, I have picked up a dupe to this gold bauble. Now this gold bauble is six pound in the white company and I've picked one up from the range that is very similar and it was £1.59. So again, if you wanted to put a lot of these on your tree and you were going to buy the White Company one, it would cost quite a lot of money. But go to the range, spend a couple of quid on these ones and nobody would know the difference. It looks very much the same. Moving on, I did show this one last year as well, but I've noticed that the White Company have got this bauble back in. So sometimes they'll switch their baubles. There's new baubles that come in all the time, but then you'll see the old ones transitioning in. So I'm going to be duping this glistening bauble. This bauble, I think, is £6, £8. Their baubles range from £6 to £8. But I picked these ones up in TK Maxx, and these were two for £3.99. So I just thought I would show you this again. And it's just a clear bauble and it's got it looks like tiny little gems on there if you can see that but it actually does remind me of this one because even though this one's gold it's got the very much the same so like imagine just having them on your tree just them two colors i think they would be absolutely gorgeous but like i said i did pick this up from tk maxx last year um, and it was £3.99 for two. Absolutely love them. So I just thought I'd show you that one again. Now, I am going to be doing a White Company inspired Christmas tree this year on my channel. It is part of Vlogmas. So I will be showing you some of these products styled on a White Company Christmas tree. I would love to own a White Company Christmas tree with all of their baubles. However, it would be a very expensive Christmas for me because it can be pricey i'd also love a tree from balsam hill their trees are absolutely amazing as well they do some nice products okay so this next item is not on the website but it was last year because i remember looking and thinking i love them but i went into b&m and i picked up these feather wreaths now these were £3 each in B&M and I think, if I'm not mistaken, last year the White Company was selling these for £8. Now I have found an image of a White Company tree with these on last year. So I will insert it here, but these are not on the website this year, so I'm not sure if they're not selling them this year, but they definitely had them in last year. So if you want a White Company inspired Christmas tree, then go and get some of these three pounds they're absolutely gorgeous again i've bought this for that white company inspired christmas tree so i wouldn't put it on a white company inspired christmas tree if it wasn't a dupe for a white company now i know amanda said she only had about five or six items to show and i know i've got quite a lot so i am trying to get through this video so quick but again remember if you've not watched amanda then once you've watched this video, head on over to her channel because I can't wait to see what dupes she's picked up as well. So I noticed in the White Company that they've got this Joy bauble and it is £8. That is pretty steep for a Joy bauble. Now don't get me wrong, it is lovely. It is the beaded Joy bauble. Now I couldn't find a beaded one, but I did go into the range and I've just picked up this one it's just acrylic and it's got a little bit of glitter on there so it does shimmer but you could always DIY this you could make it look as though it's got beads on it by putting some really thick silver glitter on now this was £1.59 from the range and again if you wanted a few of these on your tree it's going to be a hell of a lot cheaper than the ones in the white company so there's another one like I know there was um, one in the white company that said Wish. That was last year or the year before. We've got Joy this year. 
who knows what they'll bring out next year maybe peace if they haven't already done it but i absolutely love this and i just think as an alternative to the white company one one pound 59 from the range you can't fall off sticking with b m and i noticed that they have got another dupe to the white company now it is to this pom-pom bauble now yes this pom-pom bauble is only three pounds so this is only a saving of a pound but i've picked up a dupe of that now this was two pound from b m so this was two pound and again it's duping three pound one from the white company there's not a lot more to say apart from these would add lovely texture into your tree if you had the pom-poms and the feather wreaths again that would look really nice now on the white company they have got these icicle droplets and they're in a set of four for 15 pound now I do actually like them, I love anything icicles, but I've got a few different versions of dupes of these. So the first one is this one. Now this one was £1.59 from the range, and again, you wouldn't know that this isn't from the White Company. Um, it's an icicle. You get four in the White Company for £15, and these are £1.59 each. If you were going to get four, you do the maths. You could get quite a lot of these for the price that the white company had charge you for four. So the next alternative to them icicles is from Poundland. Yes, you heard me. Poundland are doing white company dupes. So I've picked up these icicle lights and they're the string lights. Now the ones in the white company don't light up and yes they are a little bit longer than these icicles but I have to come out the box for you but I just think they look absolutely gorgeous and I think if they were lit up in your tree nobody would know that these are from Poundland. So on this you get eight and I just think you know if you want an alternative to the ones that are in the white company four would be 15 pound you could get 15 packs of these for 15 pound and you've got the added bonus that you've got some lights on your tree now i may use these in a garland on my fireplace or over a mirror i think that would look really nice just for that added touch of a little bit of light and an icicle so if you're looking for a very cheap alternative to the white company icicles then head to poundland because you can get eight for a pound okay the last alternative and i think these are the better dupes again they're from the range and they are these icicles now i'm just going to compare the two icicles for you in size so the one that i'm showing you on the left is a lot longer than the one on the right so i do think that these ones are very much dupe in the white company but i did want to give you some alternatives because obviously them lights are really nice from poundland now this has got a very heavily embellished stem and it's just got a clear ball at the end and i do think that these ones they are the better dupe now I believe these were £1.79 from the range or they may have been £1.59, they weren't expensive but again to hang these in your tree with a lot of clear baubles and the feather baubles I just think it would give you the White Company look on a budget. In the White Company they have got this white ceramic bell. Now it is £8, I don't believe it's big, I think it's only small. Now I've picked up a dupe again from B and M, but it's this, this one. Now this has got all ribbed around. Now the one in White Company isn't ribbed, but this is a very much cheaper alternative. These are three pound in B and M, and I just think for the price of one in the White Company, put a pound to it and you can get three. So I've actually picked quite a few of these up for that White Company inspired Christmas tree. Again, they've got a nice green suede on here. I would switch this if green's not your thing. Just switch it for black maybe. I would maybe put black on there. 
but I just thought for the three pound and the white company one is eight pound so nobody would know if you put these on your Christmas tree that they're not from the white company especially if your tree was very white company-esque but the one in the white company is eight pound and this one is three pound okay so I'm coming up to my last couple of items now and they are baubles so again the for your, your white company inspired Christmas tree but I've picked up a dupe to the optic round bauble now I have shown these in previous videos I think it was my range video that I showed these in so this is the one that I've seen on the white company and it's eight pound again eight pound for a bauble I think it's a little bit pricey especially you couldn't just have one you'd have to have a few especially the size of my tree my tree is about nine foot so one of these just wouldn't cut it but I did go into the range and I have picked up this dupe now this one was £1.99 I believe now it does have feathers in there but you could remove the feathers and that would look like the white company one I think I'm going to keep the feathers in because again I have mentioned it previously on my channel but I do think that feathers means that somebody is around you and I would like to think that this year um, somebody is around me at Christmas so this is the one that I've picked up as I said I think it's £1.59 this bauble it wasn't expensive not as expensive as £8 so I did pick up that one it is ribbed all the way around and then I picked up the optic drop bauble dupe so this is the one in the white company again absolutely gorgeous love it £8 but I've picked up again from the range very similar with feathers in again I would take them feathers out but it's dupe in the white company so you don't have to spend a lot to get that look and this is what my channel is all about creating that expensive look the luxury look on a budget so in my vlogmas I am going to be showing you how to decorate a tree for 30 pound believe me you're not going to want to miss it so yeah i'm absolutely over the moon with these items that i've picked up and next year i'll do exactly the same thing and i'll go onto the website have a look and see what i can pick up but that does bring me to the end of this video this is a quite a lengthy video and i'm so sorry amanda that i know you had five or six items but unfortunately Charlie went the whole hog and you know what I'm like you know me so I want to say a big massive thank you for stopping by my channel if you are new and if you've subscribed then thank you so much it does mean a lot if you are a returning viewer and you've been on my channel since day one you know I absolutely love videos like this I love bringing you cheaper alternatives to that luxury look and also don't forget to go and head on over to Amanda's channel. I do want to say a big thank you to Amanda for asking me to collaborate on this video. And I can't wait to see what you've picked up. So I'm now going to go and have a look at what Amanda's picked up. And let her know that you've come from my channel. So until next time guys. Bye.